Jared Poland, Fronos Photo. Dot com and this is a Squarespace rapid fire critique where I take one of your websites, no matter what you build it in, and give it a critique even critiquerson because I don't care what you build it in. But if you don't have a website just yet, check out squarespace.com slash fro to get a 14 day free trial. I personally use Squarespace. If you use my link, it helps me out and it gives you a discount as well. So let's get into this critique of Brett Detail photography from brettdetailphotography.com. That's the guy's website. So first off, extremely welcoming photo. I love the photo. I love what's going on with this image. I don't need to see more. Um, we got the enter. We got the contact. We have the all the, contact, the other buttons down at the bottom. Now, this is a Squarespace website. I did see that. Like I said before, I don't care what you guys submit. If you want to submit, leave some links in the comments to your website, and maybe I'll be critiquing yours. But remember, I can only critique so many of them because I am just one person. Uh, so we have it. Brett D. Terrell Photography right here. We see portraits, weddings, landscapes, everything else. Prints collection, Prince collection, contact about me, what people are saying. I love to know what they're saying, but the first things first is it looks like it takes us right to the portraits section. Now the photos look fine. I will comment on some of them soon, but it's just a mishmash of portraiture. And at the top of the page, which I absolutely love, it says limited time, get $600 of aluminum prints for free with wedding bookings. Now I would probably call them metal prints or metal slash aluminum. I wanna see what this says. So I'm gonna click here and what does this say? If for a wedding or couple shoot, please provide you and your partner's full names. Okay. Thank you for visiting my page. Please use the form to contact me in regards to any questions. Okay, so it's basically taking me here. It's fine. The one thing that gets me about the page is the grayness. I don't find that to be inviting. That's personal preference. And like I say about all critiques, this is my personal preference with what I'm seeing. It doesn't mean it's right. It doesn't mean it's wrong. It's just what I think. I don't like sites that are grayed out like this. I just would much prefer a whiter feeling site. Now, when you click back here, it's taking you back to the home page. I think if you're pushing weddings and I go ahead and I click on weddings, I see again, way too many images right here. Now, when I click on them and it brings it up full screen, that's perfectly fine. Or I hit up and it takes me back to the gallery. That's great. I like to be able to cycle through these just like we're doing right here. I'm not a big fan of showing the mishmash of this, though I don't mind it. It's not a bad thing. I just think if, if you're going to have a wedding gallery and your main focus, especially because of the top of the page is telling me that you're promoting giving $600 in free metal prints for people that book their weddings, then I would want to focus on weddings. And with that being said, the homepage maybe shouldn't be a landscape photo. It should be a wedding photo or a wedding slideshow that gets people interested if that's what you're going for. If that's what you're looking to do is make money off of weddings, then that should be your focus. So coming back to here, I'd want to see under wedding, I want to see weddings higher, more so than portraiture, and I would probably consider wedding portraits underneath the portrait section, but I would see weddings. And then under weddings, I would have engagement photos. I would have uh, portrait sessions or, or formals. I would have party and I would probably have a, a, a grouping of the ceremony or photo stories. I just think that that's important to show the wedding, not just this mix mash of all different things going here. Separate it into your best work, your best 15 to 20 shots that tell the story of what you're trying to get across. And I think that would help you book more and get rid of the dark background. I don't find that to be inviting at all. Personal preference is I like white. Um, landscapes. Wow, some beautiful landscapes here. Of course, I love this one from the beginning. And I love that shot. I really love that shot. Not so much on that shot, and I know I'm not critiquing it, but man, that's beautiful. Some of these are really super nice. Very nice job on that. Now, I'm, I, I'm really curious. Let me go to the About Me to see what this says. Cool. Love the shot of you on the page. I'm a big fan of a shot of you holding gear. It just, it, it makes it real. I'm an accomplished, well-rounded photographer based out of Calgary, Alberta, Canada, A. Having had my work viewed by millions of people around the world, I've built a following of loyal fans that span the globe. Really. Let me see if he has a huge Instagram following. Does he have a huge Instagram following? 
No. But he does have an Instagram. I'll follow it. I'm going to follow it right now because I want to see more of those works. Okay. Uh, motivated by creativity and a desire to capture the most memorable and defining moments of people's lives. All right, I need to make it larger. I'm blind. I'm blind. Um, meet people's eye. Incorporate photojournalistic style to my wedding and event pho uh, photography by acquiring balance, blah, 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 with a passion and capture the moment and screens. Okay, I wonder what he's really looking for. If you would like to get to know more, me more, uh, interested in having myself as your photographer, I would strongly encourage you to fill out the contact form so we can get in touch and talk more. I hope to hear from you soon. All right, that's cool. He's talking in first person. I love first person talking. That's cool. Prints and collections. Oh, I guess I could buy this photo. Can I buy this? Well, how do I buy it? Okay, how do I buy it? I want to buy the damn print. I guess it's not prints and collections. Below, I have cultivated a collection of some of my most popular prints where the image, all photos on my page are available for prints. However, this gallery is meant to simply provide the best of the best. That's what I say. Simply the decision-making process. Below the gallery, you'll find a future de further details about, oh, all the way down here. I hate the fact that it's all the way down here. Let's see, 32 by 48, 24 by 36, paper, matte, aluminum, $500, not bad. Keep in mind that a 24 by 36 at Adorama Picks will cost you $200 just for the, the, the material itself. So not bad. I would consider buying some of that. I would put the pricing up top because, or make this something that I could purchase from. I don't hate it. I love the photos for sale. I'm just curious basically what you're trying to do. What are people saying? Okay, so with what the people are saying, Paige, I like to see photos that you took. Here, I'm turning over here, darn it. So what I want to see on the what people are saying page is I want to see a photo from the shoot that you did for these people. That's going to be cool because they're going to be like, this guy took awesome photos. We'll show a damn photo. It's a photo website. So that's what I recommend doing there. I like what's going on here. I'm going to Rappy McRapperson this up right here. I like the social buttons. I like how everything is here. Um, let's see his Facebook. He's always open. He's open always. Well, that's a good thing. So it looks like he's pushing weddings quite quite heavily. I would make sure that's reflected on your site a little more. I don't know that I would put everything else in here personally, especially a photo like this. I saw this. This is not a good photo. This is not representative of your work. Get rid of this photo altogether because it does not belong on your website at all. Oops, I hit escape. On Squarespace, if you hit the escape button and you don't turn that off on the back end, it's going to take me to the login screen. I highly suggest you go in there and you get rid of that. I get what you're doing here. You're taking pictures of the spa, but with that trash can up front, it is absolutely terrible. This shouldn't be there. You should focus on portraits, weddings, landscape, not everything else. Sell your prints. They're beautiful. Contact me. Perfect. This, no, not per. I can't say perfect. It works. So to recap real quick, oh, let me see. Thank you, bookings. I promise to respond to you as quickly as possible. For, for more immediate response, please feel free to call or text me. Well, that's pretty cool. Uh, you should put your Snapchat there and say Snapchat me. No, don't, don't actually put your Snapchat there and say Snapchat me unless you actually are going to do that. I would, I, would, I would clean up the site in terms of the visual. I would go with a white background. To me, the gray just seems amateurish, and I lose the, the images in there. I think on white, it would pop. It would feel great. Wedding dresses, they're white. You're trying to sell weddings. You want it to feel vibrant. I would make the site more vibrant. Images, fantastic. Love the landscapes. Love the fact that you can purchase them. I would maybe consider tying in with Smug Mug to sell your prints, because then you can pick where to print them, and you don't really have to do anything. Though, I would rather have the stuff shipped to me so I can sign it and number it and send it out. So keep that into con take that into consideration. You can incorporate Smug Mug into a Squarespace website. Um, you just need to sign up for the Smug Mug. I think that's a great idea to use Smug Mug to get your prints to sell. That's something that a lot of people always ask is how do you sell your prints? Smug Mug is a good way to do that. It's a good turnkey solution. So that is another Squarespace rapid fire critique. If you would like your get your stuff critiqued, the way that you do that is look on Facebook for when I recommend or when I say, hey, I'm looking for more websites to critique. Or you can tweet them at me. You can leave them down here in comments on Facebook or on the YouTube so that maybe we do 
do look at them. Remember, I can't do every one of them, but I will try to do as many as possible so I can give them a critique. So again, if you'd like to try Squarespace out yourself, go to squarespace.com slash fro to get a 14-day free trial. If you go ahead and sign up for an entire year and use the code fro, you get 10% off. And by using my affiliate link, we talk about business all the time, I get something out of it, you get something out of it. And one more thing that I will give you is a two and a half hour guide called the Fronos Photo Guide to Building Your Online Presence. Go to fronosphoto.com slash branding to get a free two and a half hour guide that is about any type of website that you build. It's not just about Squarespaces. It's a free guide to download. So go ahead and do that. And I'm going to leave it right there. Thank you guys very much for watching. Jared Poland, fronosphoto.com. See ya.